Hello everyone, the seekers of knowledge. Welcome to the gardening, which is a way of showing that you believe in tomorrow. Whether you're a beginner or a seasoned gardener, join our green community, where we share some tips that will help you to cultivate your passion for gardening. Today, we will discuss most interesting topic, ZZ plant propagation. Firstly, let's see the overlook of ZZ plant. It has attractive, glossy, dark green leaves appearance which is scientifically known as Zamiococca zamifolia. It has gained popularity as a houseplant, let's see, how to propagate ZZ plant. The first step is, choose a mature ZZ plant with multiple stems which is free from any diseases. The second step is, use a sharp knife to cut a stem from the parent plant, and allow the cutting to dry for a few days to prevent rotting. Use a combination of perlite, peat moss, and sand to create rooting medium. Make a hole in the rooting medium and insert the cutting. Gently press the soil around the cutting to secure it in place. Place the potted cutting in a warm and bright location, maintain a temperature and keep the soil slightly moist. Wait for root development, it usually takes several weeks to a few months to grow. Once the cutting has established a good root system, you can transplant it into a larger pot. Let's discuss the different methods for propagating ZZ plant. Number 1 Stem Cuttings This is the most common method for propagating ZZ plant. Take a stem cutting from a healthy parent plant and place it in a rooting medium. Keep the cutting moist and provide appropriate conditions for root development. Number 2 Leaf Cuttings Take a leaf from a healthy parent plant and insert it partially into a rooting medium. Keep the leaf moist and provide suitable conditions for root development. Number 3 Division ZZ plants can be divided by separating the rhizomes of established plant into multiple sections. Carefully remove the plant from its pot and separate the rhizomes, ensuring that each section has roots attached. Number 4. Offsets, also called pups. ZZ plants produce offsets or pups, which are small plantlets that grow at the base of the parent plant. These can be carefully separated from the parent plant and potted individually. Number 5 Air Layering This method involves creating a small wound on a healthy stem of the parent plant and rooting in medium. Roots will develop at the wound site, and once they are well established, the rooted section can be cut off and potted. Thanks for watching video subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for watching latest videos.